hi friends welcome to my channel in this video let's see how we can print the diamond pattern to print this pattern first what we need to observe is we need to divide this pattern into two halves that is upper half and the lower half now let's see how we can print the upper half okay if i want to print the upper half if you observe here the number of spaces in each row are getting decreased that is 5 spaces 4 3 2 1 so we need to write a loop so that the spaces are getting printed in a decreasing fashion okay followed by numbers we need to print numbers in the incrementing order that is 1 1 2 1 2 3 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 5 so how we can do this for this first we need to consider how many rows we want to print number of rows till here that is 1 2 3 4 5 so initialize variable initialize variable int rows equals 5 ok so this is for upper half upper half of the pattern ok int rows equals 5 we need to consider one variable then we need to write a loop to iterate through these rows how we can do that by initializing one variable int i equals 1 i lesser than or equals to rows then i plus plus ok this is one loop we are using now here <coughs> for rows next what i need to do i need to consider two more rows two more uh, for loops one for spaces for printing the spaces in each row and another for printing the numbers so for doing that so we need to consider one nested for loop for this that is for int j equals rows j greater than or equals to i j minus minus ok j minus minus so for this loop what i need to do i need to print the spaces in which fashion I need to print in the decreasing order that is 5 spaces 4 3 2 and 1 space like this in the decreasing order that is why I have initialized decrement operator for j for loop that is for each time the number of spaces will be decremented here in, I need to pr print a statement system dot out dot print of space to print the spaces ok so this is the inner loop now what we have done we have printed spaces from here to here in each row next we need to print the numbers in which fashion we need to print first line first row 1 then 1 2 1 2 3 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 5 that is in an increasing order that we can do by considering one more loop for int k equals 1 k lesser than or equals to i k plus plus ok here what I need to do I need to print the numbers system dot out dot print of value of k value of k will give us the numbers which we want to print with some space ok this is one more inner loop so one loop for spaces and another loop for numbers so after printing this number I need to go to the next line right so if if I am printing the spaces and number if I am not going to the next line what will happen 1 2 will get printed in the same row so to avoid that to print in the next row what we need to do we need to consider a statement system dot out dot print ln we need to consider this statement to go to the next line ok so this is how we are printing the upper half so if you just go through this how the logic works let us quickly see this i equals 1 i lesser than or equals to rows rows value is 5 i lesser than or equals to 5 yes condition is true it will come inside the inner loop inside inner loop j equals rows rows means 5 j value is 5 5 greater than or equals to 1 yes condition is true so it will print a space in the beginning in the first row then again j minus minus j minus minus means 
j was equal to rows that was 5 now j minus minus will be j equals 4 4 greater than or equals to 1 yes condition is true one more space then 3 greater than or equals to 1 yes one more space 2 greater than or equals to 1 one more space 1 greater than or equals to 1 one more space so 5 spaces will be printed then 0 right <coughs> sorry 0 greater than or equals to 1 yes condition is wrong here so condition is false then what will happen it will come out of this loop it will go here now the spaces got printed 5 spaces now it is coming to this loop that is another inner loop k k equals 1 1 lesser than equals to i 1 lesser than equals to 1 yes condition is true so number 1 will be printed here then k will be incremented k will become 2 2 lesser than equals to 1 no the condition is false here so what will happen it will come out of this loop and it will go to this statement this statement system dot out dot print ln what will happen it will go to the next line so we have we have printed five spaces with one number followed by next line it will go to next line then second iteration i value will become 2 now then again same procedure it will follow to print 1 2 1 2 3 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 5 okay so now upper half pyramid we have already printed now what you need to observe is while printing the lower half of the pyramid that is lower half of the diamond pattern we should be very careful here why because if we are using rows value 5 here what will happen again 1 2 3 4 5 will get printed here instead of 1 2 3 4. but we need to start from 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 1 2 1 we don't need again 1 2 3 4 5 here to form the pair diamond pattern so what we need to do for that for lower half to print the lower half I need to consider for int i equals rows for int i equals rows i greater than or equals to 1 i minus minus this will be the outer loop okay this will be the outer loop then inner loop <coughs> because why I have consider i equals rows i greater than or equals to 1 i minus minus in this case because we want to print in the inverted fashion inverted fashion means decreasing order decreasing order what we need to do we need to consider loop with decrement operator right so from i equals rows means from 5 5 greater than or equals to 1 then then it will be decremented 4 greater than or equals to 1 3 greater than or equals to 1 we are considering this loop in the decreasing fashion okay so again in this case how see if you observe in this case in the lower half again here if you consider the spaces are getting increased in each case see in the first row what is happening one space then two then three then four see spaces are getting increased here and the numbers are getting decreased right so for uh, spaces are getting increased means what we need to do we need to consider another loop for this another loop that is for int j equals here what you need to observe is 1 2 3 4 5 again I should not print here with spaces and spaces also I need to avoid to do that what we need to do I need to consider rows plus 1 previously we consider rows but here we are considering rows plus 1 because I need to start from 6th row right 1 2 3 4 5 5 rows has been printed already I need to consider from 6th row to consider from 6th row what I need to do I need to do j equals rows plus 1 okay rows plus 1 then j greater than or equals to i j minus minus okay now what i need to do for this i need to print spaces spaces that is system dot out dot print of spaces here the spaces should be in the increasing fashion that's where we are using j minus minus that is from 6 rows plus 1 means 6 6 greater than or equals to i condition is true right 6 greater than or equals to i condition is true then one space will be printed in the similar way the spaces will get increased in each row while printing each row spaces will get increased now to print the numbers how to print these numbers to print these numbers we need to consider one more loop that is for int k equals 1 k 
के लेस देन आई के प्लस प्लस के लेस देन आई के प्लस प्लस वाई वी आर नॉट कंसिडरिंग के लेस देन और इक्वल्स टू आई इन दिस केस बिकॉज आई वैल्यू विल बी फाइव बट आई नीड फ्रॉम सिक्स रो दैट इज सिक्स रो आई नीड टू प्रिंट दैट इज वन टू थ्री फोर आई डोंट नीड फिफ्थ नंबर नाउ इन दिस केस दैट्स द रीजन वी आर यूजिंग के लेस देन आई instead of k less than or equal to i okay that is now i need to print the numbers system dot out dot print of k value k plus space okay this is how we need to print the lower half now after printing the lower half while printing the lower half what will happen I need to go to the next line. Once I print one, two, three, four, five, I need to go to the next line. To go to the next line, I need to use this statement: system dot out dot print ln. Okay, system dot out dot print ln. This will make us go to the next line to print the numbers. If we are not using this statement, what will happen? All the numbers will get printed in the same row. To go to the next row, we need to go. We need to use this statement: system dot out dot print ln. this is how how we can print the diamond pattern to uh, to print the diamond pattern we need to consider upper half and lower half then concatenate upper half with the lower half when concatenating lower half we need to be careful by using rows plus 1 because we should not repeat this row if we are using j equals rows what will happen again 1 2 3 4 5 again it will get printed right we don't want to print that we we want to start from 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 1 2 1 in the decreasing order that's the reason we are using rows plus 1 in the lower half case now let's quickly switch to eclipse and let's execute this program and check the output how diamond pattern can be achieved okay let's quickly jump to eclipse Okay, we already created Java project that is patterns inside SRC folder, number patterns package. Inside this package, I'll create a class diamond pattern. Okay, public static void main. Inside this, I need to initialize variable int row equals five because I want to print five rows for the upper half of the diamond pattern right int row equals 5 then for int i equals 1 i less than or equals to rows i plus plus then inner loop i need to write that int j equals rows j greater than or equals to i j minus minus this is for printing the spaces system dot out dot print of i need to print the spaces okay this is one loop then another loop we need to consider for printing the numbers that is int k equals 1 k less than or equals to i k plus plus okay now inside this loop i need to write a statement System dot out dot print of k value k plus with some space. Okay, now this will give us the upper half of the diamond pattern. This will give upper half of the diamond pattern. So after coming out of this loop, what I need to do? I need to use system dot out dot print ln. for going to the next line after printing one line i need to go to the next line right so i am using system dot out dot print ln so now for the this is for upper half of the diamond pattern upper half diamond pattern now for lower half lower half of the diamond pattern again i need to consider one more loop that for int i equals rows i greater than equals to 1 i minus minus because in this while printing the lower half diamond we want inverted pyramid pattern right that's why we are 
using decrement operator in this case because the numbers should be decremented and rolls also will be decremented spaces will be incremented so what we need to do we need to use int j equals rows plus 1 j greater than or equals to i j minus minus so inside i need to print the spaces that is system dot out dot print of spaces okay now we have printed spaces also next i need to print numbers int k equals 1 k less than i k plus plus i need to print the numbers that is system dot out dot print ln of k value k plus with some space so after printing uh, spaces and values what i need to do i need to print i need to go to the next line right system dot out dot print ln to go to the next line okay this is the logic behind diamond pattern let's quickly review this before executing the program okay int i equals 1 i lesser than equals to rows i plus plus j equals rows j greater than equals to i j minus minus we are printing space then k equals 1 k lesser than equals to i k plus plus we are printing the value of k that is for numbers then going to the next line now for lower half i equals rows i greater than equals to 1 i minus minus j equals rows plus 1 j greater than equals to 1 j minus minus we are printing spaces then we are printing numbers okay now let's execute this program and check the output run as java see here it's not printing in the required diamond pyramid fashion why because we have used system dot out dot print ln so system dot out dot print ln what will happen the numbers will get printed into the next row print ln is used for printing next row so we need to avoid using print ln okay now if you observe we have achieved diamond pattern that is upper half pyramid then lower half pyramid lower half pyramid we are using j equals rows plus 1 so that we will not print this row 1 2 3 4 5 okay to avoid that we are using 1 2 3 4 from 1 2 3 4 this is how we are printing diamond pattern thank you so much for watching this video guys please like comment and share this video and kindly subscribe to my channel in order to watch more videos thank you so much bye take care